give you a general view in about a few days from this footage taken this crossing is actually due to be upgraded as you can see they kind of cut a slot in here but they also passed it so nobody will get their tires punctured or anything but as you can see for a lot of years this is all wood and concrete or asphalt in between there most of these crossings um, on the slide have either had concrete slabs have been put in place instead of wooden uh, slats as this one but as you can see over time this has been worn out and with CSX about to do some track work here in about a few days this crossing was due to be fixed and as you can see some of the cars that have to slowly go over this crossing including the times I had to but as you can see here yeah it's in pretty rough shape so time for CSX to make a fix on this thing a little bit more of a daylight option to see how rough this crossing looks And the high railer just doing a final inspection. They're going to be getting work tomorrow. A little bit more of a perspective. You can see how worn down it's been over time. This is what all they got to replace, and it's going to be starting tomorrow. Those crossings is going to be closed off. You have a kind of rough view how this rough this crossing is. See what I mean? Very rough. As you can see, the uh, cross has been ripped up starting today. It's slated for tomorrow, but they end up starting it early. So, just kind of seeing the work being done. They had to wait for some of the work to be done for the day, but you can clearly see how much they've done. This crossing was a bit rough, but I bet you they're going to redo it the whole nine years. I mean, they laid uh, some fresh ballast in there. There's some of the old ties over there. And then over here. So, that's what you see. Well, after the crossing being closed for two days, starting on the 7th, all the day in the 8th, today's the 9th, they actually opened it up and it looks a lot better. It's the deteriorated state that it was in. 
they what they actually did was they uh, put some uh, rubber spacers in where they did it very similar to what they done with the uh, book out row which is next crossing down going towards the uh, the mountain itself but it had to be done especially with all the holes in the road that they had especially along the track in where the, the old board used to be the boards themselves were in there for the longest and you see they've been taken out but there you have it that's the result so we still got a little bit of a curfew going on so there won't be much trains here for a while so CSX is in the process of uh, replacing the last of the uh, concrete ties between Nashville and here uh, which shouldn't take them long along with any rail that has to be repaired or replaced so guys uh, thought I'd share this with you uh, my chase mobile should be finished up in repairs and I got some different plans in mind, so stay tuned guys, thanks for tuning in.